Last week in the vlog, I said that Jesus runs toward suffering, and I said that his children, when they see suffering, they do not run away from it, they run towards it. If you ask Jesus why he did his miracles, he would not tell you what John told you. John said in John chapter 20, verse 30, he said, Jesus did many other miracles not recorded. These are recorded that you might believe that he is the Son of God and by believing have life in his name. If you ask Jesus why he did the miracles, the man at the pool of Bethesda and blind Bartimaeus and all the rest of them, if you ask Jesus why he did the miracles, he would not give you a theological answer. He would sit and say to you, I saw someone suffering and I wanted to help them. I saw someone hurting and my heart was moved. Jesus was kindness exemplified. And when he saw suffering, he went to it. When Lazarus dies, he makes the comment to Mary and Martha, I'm the resurrection and the life. He that believes in me, though he dies, yet shall he live. And whosoever lives and believes in me shall never die. He was declaring that Lazarus was not dead. Lazarus was alive in heaven. But 20 minutes later, he is standing at the graveside of Lazarus, and he sees Mary and Martha weeping, and he sees the friends of Lazarus weeping, and the Bible says he was moved with great emotion, and Jesus began to weep. I don't care what type of suffering it was. He was there and his heart was tied in with those people's hearts. I don't care what kind of trial you are going through right now. Financial, relationship, health, the death of a loved one, addictions with your teenage children. I don't care what you are going through right now. Jesus looks at you and his heart immediately begins to wrap around your hearts. Jesus weeps when you weep. The Bible says he keeps every tear we shed in a little box. He knows when we're hurting. Before we ever pray to him about our situation, Psalm 139, God already knows it's going on. If you ever feel alone in this life, don't feel alone for more than a second or two. God himself has come. In our Savior's name, amen.